It's the Warrior of the Week, and we're here with Airman First Class Keegan Robbins. How are you today? I'm doing pretty good. How are you? I'm doing fantastic. Can you tell me a little bit about what you do at Vance Air Force Base? Yeah, um, I'm in aviation resource management. We are the last people that the pilots go to before they step out to fly. Um, we keep all their documents up to date. We give them the tail, uh, the tail numbers, their line numbers, and yeah, that's all I can think about. So you're probably their favorite person to see. Uh, sometimes. Sometimes? Yeah, they're very, uh, they have a lot of questions for us, so I would say so. So you're you're probably their favorite person, but not necessarily the other way around? There you go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Keegan, I got a question for you. Mm-hmm. Uh, you're talking about giving them the planes to the jets, and, and up until this moment, I'd never really thought that obviously there's more than one T1, more than one T6, and you got a training pilot, um, a, a lieutenant comes out getting ready to get in the plane, how do you decide which plane to assign them? Is it, I mean, is it just going down a list of planes that are available type thing? or um, Maintenance takes care of the plane, but every single morning whenever we're opening, maintenance will bring a list of the planes and the line numbers, and then they'll give it to us, and we just plug it in. Gotcha. So how long have you been here at Vance Air Force Base? Two months. Two months. That's not very long at all. It's not. Just getting started. All right. Have you had any time to kind of wander around Enid a little? I've been around Enid a little bit. I've been more around OKC. Okay. All right. What does OKC have that we don't? Movie theater. Okay. All right. You got me. (laughs) That's about to change. Yes, it is. Yeah. Yeah, we are about to get a movie theater, a really cool movie theater. I'm pretty excited about it. Um, You should definitely wander around, though, because we've got a lot of really cool stuff. We are a small-ish town, but we're a small town with a lot of neat things. What do you like to do in your free time? Um, I mostly, I like to play games. I like to hang out with my friends. Um, That's all I really found around here so far. I found a lot of good people, though. All right. Uh, So where are you from? I'm from Indiana and Illinois. Oh, that's kind of a ways. Is it very it is. much different from Oklahoma? Um, you'd be surprised. I'm from a very small town, so this is kind of like where I'm from. Not too much of a chance to get very homesick then. It's not, no. No. <laughs> well, okay, we got to define small town, because I've been to Indiana and in, in Illinois, lots mm-hmm. and lots of farmland. How yes. many people were in your graduating class in high school? I would say around 300, okay. 400. So, so the Chisholm High School, that would be about that size of school yeah. system. Smaller than Enid High, obviously, yeah. but bigger than what Kaylee and I come from. <laughs> yeah, Alan, tell them how many were in your graduating class. I had the largest class ever for Burlington High School. Thank you very much. Okay. With, with 18 people. Wow. It was bigger than, and most, most classes right now are four and five people per year. Yeah. Wow. It's still bigger than my graduating class, which was 13, so... <laughs> <laughs> So, what do you see as your future in the Air Force? Um, I do. I was right now plan on sticking around for the 20 years. Okay. Um, I really want to elevate to that next level of where everybody comes to me for stuff. I want to have that level of responsibility mm-hmm. and discipline. Um, I really want to just learn a lot and take in everything that people are giving me. I want to take all the advice I can and learn from what I'm doing. Very cool. How long have you been in the Air Force? Um, Close to a year, this January. Okay, so one down, 19 to go. You're doing great. (laughs) Yes, yes. (laughs) What prompted you, Keegan, to join the Air Force in the first place? There's got to be a story. I was in JROTC in high school. Um, I had two great instructors, a chief and a colonel, and they had a lot of influence on me, and they led me in the right direction. Do you stay in contact with them? I stay in contact with the colonel. Um, I haven't had the chance to talk to the chief. Um, Right before I enlisted, I did plan on going guard, and that's when I talked to the chief because he ended up being guard. But I kind of lost that connection whenever I switched over to active duty, and I haven't been able to get a hold of him. So So what what made that decision for you, active or guard? Um, It's kind of funny. It wasn't a lot of things. My dad just kind of told me, like, hey, you need to, like, travel. Like, you need to get out of this small town. I mean, I ended up here, but, you know, it's not it's not going to be the only place I'm going to go. So, 18 people. I've got to go back to the 18 people in my class. <laughs> yeah. We've got 50,000 people in Enid. This is a big town. Yeah. 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 I really thought I'd moved to the big city and done something when we moved yeah. here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
look at look at your you're talking about the things that you would like to do so obviously you're going to be in, in leadership in a few years but uh mm-hmm. what it, will it be administrative leadership what would you like to do with your career in the air force is it primarily leadership or is there a field that you're really looking at um leadership is definitely the, the biggest thing yeah. all right you said you like to read i do have you checked out the bookstores that are here in town I have not checked them here in town, but again, I have seen the ones in OKC. Listen, all right. So we may not have a movie theater, but mm-hmm. we do have some really cool bookstores. We've got Putnam Six, which is new books. We okay. have Old Soul, which they have used books. I don't know about you. I'm a big book. I'm a big reader, mm-hmm. and I like the smell of old books. So I'm I'm an old book kind of girl. But they have tons of books. You don't have to go to OKC to get your books. Is what I'm saying. Just just right here. Check it out. All right. We need to take you shopping is what she's doing. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Keegan, yeah. we appreciate you, man. Keep doing what you're doing. Yeah, thank you. Right.